Hi everybody, Susie Q here at Q Aquatics. And let me give you a little update on my pond for weekend number two. Got a little progress. We had a little setback. We had to pull back the lining and let me explain. <laughs> update on the pond um, I'm right now I just put some water in to wash off some of the rock we didn't I didn't get any rock yet well I got a little bit of rock I put in let's see if I can zoom in that's just an old aquarium pump to keep the water from being stagnant we got the skimmer built sealed leveled I still have to build up one or two walls but we pulled the lining back went about two feet wider and another foot down so I held up the process a tad bit so that I we could I know next year I'm gonna just figure that oh I want it deeper and better and what I did is I put the rocks that we found here I do not like them they're coming out they're coming out um, I know I will find rocks I know it I mean build it and they will come right <laughs> did go to a pond store and got a tadpole which I'm so stoked about he's in one of my summer tubs right now but I put water in to see that I, my leveler said it was level. It's obviously not level. I have to build up that part of the wall, probably about five inches and I'll pack it and I got plenty of dirt. <laughs> I got plenty of dirt to do that. So I just wanted to give you an update. We got a lot done for tearing it down and rebuilding. Very stoked. Last night had my first critter come to visit. It was a little, oh, Capone is out. I gotta show you this. I know he's not a, this is my Russian tortoise. He's just in a wheelbarrow hanging out. My daughter's playing with him right now. Uh, she's gonna be building him a, a mansion, like a two-story place to live indoors and outdoors. So I am so excited for her. She's a six-year-old rescue. Hi, buddy, she loves to play. She loves to play. And my daughter just told me to get her a red ball because she'll be attracted to the red. So that's exciting. And then over here, I know I'm babbling, but I'm late for work. Oh, they're working on my bridge. See how short these are? That's because my hips didn't fit between the two. <laughs> they fit now. And I'm building a four tier garden in memorial of all our past pets have always gone in this part of the, the yard. So I got the first two started, the first two rows started. I got to get some mulch and a little bit more topsoil, but I'm just using the dirt that we used, that we dug up. I'm really gonna like this. The bottom, this bottom layer isn't even started yet. So, and I gotta get stakes to put in to hold the wood up. So I'm pretty stoked. Like that's, a, that's I mean, it was a busy, busy weekend and next weekend's Mother's Day. So technically I get to do whatever I want.
filled up the pond. It's oh my gosh, I'm in love. So I still don't have any rock. I only have the rock that I dug up from the yard so far. Don't mind the mess. Well, okay, so I think we measured it. It is 10, 10 by 12. This is going to be the waterfall right here. Here's the waterfall. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I am in heaven. You guys have no idea. And I really like this the way that wall came out. That's just from rocks that we dug up in the yard. I mean, we have some more, a couple more of those individual rocks, but not enough. So if anybody knows where you get free rocks, I'm checking Craigslist. Oh, look at this. This is after the end of weekend number two, coming up on Mother's Day weekend. So, I think I'm going to be able to get some more stuff done on it, but I am really liking it. I couldn't help. I started just filling up the pond to, you know, clean off the rock, and I'm like, I'm filling it. I'm filling it. I'm, you know, this is, there's the skimmer, and that's where I got the extension. I got a guy coming out to help me with uh, electricity. I don't have any electricity outside, so he's going to put a box underneath the porch for me. And I really love the circulation. This is where the waterfall is going to be. Say hi, Zoe. Hi. Wait, I missed it. Say hi, Zoe. Hi, hi Amy. Oh, we got Capone out. Are you going for take Capone playing before it rains? Yeah. Capone loves the garden. We got to put her in the dirt. You want to pet her before I put her down? Yeah. Pet her shell. There you go. Hey, Capone. Capone loves it outside. Just loves it. Let her run around when she's down there. You're gonna let her walk around? She likes it out here. We should get her a little, I'm supposed to pick her up a little red ball. So that is the end. A weekend, two weekends so far. So we got a dug liner, the subliner liner. Then we pulled it all back and went farther from here, all the way out to here, and went down another foot. I took the cement blocks out of the center lower box. I did not like that at all. And what I was thinking, right here is real deep. It's like three foot. Yeah, right there. That's just a, goodness, that's a tank pump. So that's not even going to be there. But I'm going to put light diffuser, black light diffuser there, for, and then leave an opening so Koi can have a little, my Koi can have a little hideaway. But I really like it. So now I'm gonna walk up to the top of the porch to see what it looks like. Skimmer's working great. So hopefully this weekend I'll be able to get the waterfall built. It might not have, you know, it may not be cam camouflaged with rock, but I'll get the waterfall built. Get it stable. Pretty lilacs, love them. That's why I wanted the waterfall to come through the lilacs. So here we go. So when I come out my kitchen onto the porch, this is what I'll see. Oh, ho, ho. And I got some, some plants that I overwintered from my summer tubs last year. Other, I got some new plants. This is just like a oil change bucket that I've been washing out that I think I might use as part of the waterfall. And then here is three tadpoles. I got some more tadpoles. Really liking it. And then I want to put rock here as a patio on the edge of the pond. Here's my bridge. So that is the end of weekend number two. Hopefully I'll have an update after Mother's Day weekend and I'll have the waterfall built. Thanks for checking in and checking on my pond build. I couldn't be happier. I am like riding a cloud right now. See you guys later.